What's going on everybody? It's your boy Dougie here with another DoorDash series review. Today uh, we got our wings from, hold on I forgot the name of it, let me look it up. Oh uh, man of course there goes Hoku. So it's Kenwood Food and Beverage. Now this is actually interesting because you know like some of the other videos that I've told you about Kenwood Food and Beverage is one of those things that kind of just popped up because of DoorDash, you know, being so popular now. Kenwood Food and Beverage is actually a combination of four different restaurants. And I'm looking at it right now. So you have Venice Salad and Bowls, uh, Chicken Republic, I don't know, Shaky Shaky. I think it is. I don't know. It looks like it's some kind of like shake and malt place. And then Red Cow. I'm sure a lot of you, if you live in the Twin Cities area, you're familiar with Red Cow. So we got the wings from Kenwood, uh, but they are the Red Cow Japanese sticky wings. Uh, and I don't really need any of this, whatever. So for starters, we'll let you see it. Now I have had wings from Red Cow before, not through delivery, um, but I've just had their standard buffalo. They're they're one of my favorites. Um, these are obviously delivery, so it's going to be different. And one actual issue with these was originally they were supposed to get here at like 5:45, um, but apparently DoorDash wasn't able to, I guess, find a driver to pick it up. So now it's 6.45 and they finally got here. I don't know if they were sitting for a while or I don't know what the deal was, but finally we have them. Again, this is the Japanese sticky. So let's find out. These are, I know, I have a couple friends that work at Red Cow. These are one of their more popular flavors. Uh, I mean, these they don't, they still feel warm, so it doesn't feel like they were sitting for too long. So I would guess that maybe they Maybe they reheated them, I don't know. But what it comes down to, with this review, keep in mind, it's not the restaurant's fault. It's a DoorDash issue, because it took so long to get a driver, I guess. Here we go. Um... I mean... I guess. Yeah, I don't know. Right off the bat when I opened the box, I wasn't too fond of the smell. But, I mean, they're not bad. They're not bad at all. I just, I'm not sure. Let me keep going here. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, I don't think I could really explain to you what the, what it tastes like. I don't really feel like there's a taste. Nothing that blows my mind. Well, there's a little bit. There's a little bit of a taste. So, I mean, it's good quality of meat. You know, I can't complain about that. This flavor, for me, I would say is a no-go. I would just stick with their standard buffalo. And I mean, I love, I love the buffalo wings at Red Cow. I would definitely say, I mean, you could try this if you want to. It's not hot, so there's that. But yeah, I mean, me personally, I think I'm just going to stick to the buffalo wings from Red Cow. And maybe I'll just order it straight through Red Cow rather than go through this Kenwood food and beverage. Um, I don't know if there's a price difference. I don't think there is. Yeah, so for the wings, I got one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Okay, well, I'm counting seven. There should be eight. So that's weird. Um, okay, so I got seven wings when I should have gotten eight. I don't know if that's the restaurant or if that's 
I don't know what happened there. Um, and 13, 13.25 I think is what they cost. Again, yeah, I would just stick to the Buffalo. These are all right, but they're nothing to brag about. On a scale of one to 10, Red Cow slash Kenwood food and beverage, Japanese sticky chicken wings. We're gonna go with a six. Eh, no, we're gonna go with a five and a half. I'm gonna give the restaurant the benefit of the doubt because it took so damn long for them to get here. But like I said, the Japanese sticky is nothing all that impressive to me. That's just personally. For you, it might be different. So yeah, we'll say a five and a half out of ten. And that's all I got for you. Appreciate you guys tuning in. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell, do all that. And let me know where you want me to get wings from next time. All right? Peace.